In this module, we shall discuss some more properties of cosets and uh, which are very useful in establishing the Lagrange theorem. Let H be a subgroup of G and A belongs to G. The cardinality of AH equal to BH. AH equal to HA. It means that left coset equal to right coset if and only if the this condition is satisfied. H equal to AHA inverse. Number 8. AH is a subgroup of G if and only if A belongs to H. Now we prove one by one these properties. Now we prove that cardinality of AH equal to cardinality of BH. To prove this, we are considering a function phi from AH to BH which is defined by phi AH equal to BH for every H belonging to H. Here you can see that AH is the element of AH domain and B small h is an element of the codomain BH. Every element of AH maps on BH. If we prove this map is bijective, then their cardinality would be equal. So, uh, we have to check that phi is 1 to 1 or on 2. To see that phi is 1 to 1, we have to uh, compute, check the condition of one to one functions. We are taken two elements in domain, arbitrary two elements, AH1 and AH2 in the domain AH, and we are assuming that their images are equal, phi AH1 equal to phi AH2. And we have to prove that the elements are equal. That is AH1 equal to AH2. When we apply B inverse on both sides, we shall get H1 equal to H2. And now we are multiplying A on both sides, we shall get AH1 equal to AH2 as we required. So we have proved that phi is 1 to 1. And now we check phi, whether phi is on to or not. Uh, you can easily see that the pre-image of every element in codomain we have uh, in domain. Uh, the in codomain, the element is BH and its pre-image is AH. And uh, you can easily see that phi is on 2. It means that their cardinality AH and BH are equal as required. Now we establish the next property AH equal to HA left coset equal to right coset if and only if H equal to AHA inverse. We are given AH equal to HA left coset equal to right coset if and only if a H equal to H prime A for some H prime belonging to H and uh, we can apply A inverse on both sides on right 
वी शैल गेट ए एच ए इनवर्स इक्वल टू एच प्राइम विद इफ एंड ओनली इफ कंडीशन फॉर सम एच प्राइम बिलोंगिंग टू एच एंड इट इम्प्लाइज डेट एच इक्वल टू ए एच ए इनवर्स विद इफ एंड ओनली इफ कंडीशन सो वी हैव एस्टेब्लिश्ड प्रॉपर्टी सेवन नो वी प्रूव प्रॉपर्टी एट ए एच इज अ सब ग्रुप ऑफ जी इफ एंड ओनली इफ ए इज इन एच फर्स्ट वी prove the direct implication suppose a h is subgroup of g then e is in a h and we can write e h and a h are not disjoint so by property 4 we shall get a h equal to e h if uh, we know that by property 4 either the cosets are disjoint or coincident so so a h is coincident with e h which is equal to h in this way we have proved the direct implication uh, now we are proving the converse implication we are assuming that a belongs to h and uh, we have to prove that a h is subgroup of g and you can easily see that when we multiply a by h we shall get the same subgroup h and uh, which is a subgroup of g so we have established this property as you have seen in many examples the property 8 Uh, in which we have seen that when element belongs to h and we multiply this element by the coset we shall get the same group subgroup of g and uh, uh, the property number 6 is very important cardinality of ah equal to cardinality of bh this property would help us in establishing the lagrange theorem 